Hello friends, welcome back once again to my video tutorial. This is Lipsa again with you. So guys, in my last video, I have described how we can add external jar files to a Java project. Okay. In today's video, we will learn how we can convert an existing Java project or not Maven project to Maven project. So let's get started guys then. So I have already opened my IntelliJ IDEA. This is the community edition of IntelliJ IDEA. So this project employee service I have created in my last video when I described how we can add external jar file to our Java project. So if I expand this external libraries, you can see we have added this com.fastlexm, Jackson code, Jackson data bind, the Jackson annotation and lumbug jar to this project. So let me expand this project. So inside my SRC, I have two class that is employee. Okay. And in employee service, I have created a list of employee and convert that list of employee to JSON object by using object mapper dot write value as string method. Okay, so for this I need the faster XML Jackson. That's why I have added the faster XML Jackson dependencies to this project. And to generate the getter setter all our constructor, no our constructor for this employee class, I have added the project lumber. That's it from the previous video. So what we'll do now, we'll convert this existing Java project employee service to a Marvel project. So how we can do this? Let's mark here. So just right click on this project employee service. Then here you have an option add framework support. Click on this add framework support. Then we have the option like whether we want to convert it to Ruby, Kotlin or Maven. So we'll click on this Maven option as we are going to convert this project to Maven project. Then click here OK. So when you click on OK, immediately form.xml file will be generated because you know in every Maven project we have a form.xml. So inside this form.xml, whatever dependencies you require for your project, you can add here. Clear? So now you can see this is my form.xml and here group id, I can change the group id like uh, form.app. I'll give the uh, group name same as my package name. Okay. Then at the that same as my project name that is employee service and the version 1.0 hyphen snapshot. Okay. So that's it in my form.xml. Now if I expand this external libraries, you can match those dependencies whatever we have added is disappeared from here because we have convert this project to Marvin project. Now if I go to my employee class, you can see errors are there. Why? Because project lumbar jar is not present now. Okay, which we have added externally in our employee service project. Clear? And if I open my employee service also, this employee service class also, you can see errors are there. Because the Texter XML Jackson dependencies is also removed from this project. So how this error will get resolved? We need to add those dependencies in our form.xml. So whatever dependency we will add in our form.xml that will download from the Maven central repository and store in your local repository. Okay. So we need now Lumbok repository as well as uh, faster XML repository. So we have added the faster XML Jackson data bind or the Jackson annotation. All those things we need to add in our form.xml. Okay. So let me just quickly add these dependencies. So to add the dependencies in the format XML, we need to add the dependencies tag. So inside this dependencies tag, we'll add our dependencies. So this is dependency. So first we need to add the lumbar jar. So let me go to my browser and search for lumbar Maven dependency. Okay. So lumbar Maven dependency, we'll go to the Maven central repository now. So here I'll select one version. And copy these dependencies. Go to your form.xml and paste it over here. Okay, so I have added the project lumbar dependency. So now I need to add the faster XML Jackson dependency as well. So again, go to your browser and search for faster XML Jackson data byte Maven dependency. So click here. This is the faster XML Jackson. Data by copy this one, go to your form.xml, paste it over here. Okay. Then we have the Jackson data bind code. So search for faster XML Jackson code. Okay, 
Kan eh? dependency Kemudian Copy this one Copy this dependency Go to the top data table and cross it over Here So now we have done with project number In HTML Jackson for data bind And Jackson for Now what is Now we need that annotation Jackson annotation dependency Okay These dependencies we have added in our previous project Okay HTML Jackson annotation So now we will add these dependencies in our form.xml so that it will be result our all is okay so now we have added all the required dependencies to our project so whatever required dependencies you need for your project you need to add it in our form.xml okay so let me click here you can see a load maven changes so we have changed to our form.xml isn't it so we need to reload this maven so that it will be downloaded from the maven central repository so click here you can see resulting Maven dependencies is going on, so it will resolve all the dependencies. Okay, so now all the dependencies are getting resolved. So again, let's go back to my entire class to check whether the error is still exist or not. See, the error is now disappeared because it finds the required dependencies. Okay, then if I go to the employee service also, you can see the error is also not there. Because we have added the faster XML dependencies in our form.xml. So it will resolve all our uh, errors. Clear? So now let me quickly run this class to check whether we are getting our response or not. Okay, so you can see in my console the JSON object is printed, which is a list of JSON objects. Clear? So that's how you can convert a non Maven project or simple Java project to Maven project. So, just we need to right click on the project, then we have the option, add framework support, you can click here, and whatever framework like Maven or Kotlin, you can choose and add it. Okay, I have already added the Maven framework support, that's why it is not populated here. Clear? So, I hope you understand this video, how we can convert a Java project or non-Maven project to Maven project. That's it for today's video guys, see you in my next video, till then thanks for watching, thank you.